Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, I'm here to do a historic brawl deck review um, from a from another deck that I saw trying to play an explorer. Uh, same deck list. You can find it uh, from the Legend uh, YouTube channel, and I'll put it in the link. In in the description below. Um, but this deck basically utilizes like El Jazi Displacer with the Blink ability that came in the recent Explorer Anthology bundle. So you're blinking like um, Skyclave, um, Professor Symbology, Don Seer. Uh, expert, expert for hand disruption, professor for card draw, sky clay for removal, and then displacer can remove the tokens that you make from the apparition. And then thought knots here gets for it's more hand disruption. Uh, matter reshaper when it dies, you can cash, you can get a uh, you can bank off getting like. Skyclave, Displacer, you know, uh, Expert, Symbology. And then for Graveyard Disruption, in case people are playing Reanimator or Unearth or whatever, uh, we got Trespasser. Uh, and then we got Thalia, Guardian of Thraven, and then my addition to the deck was Lodestone Golem for more taxes because it is, you know, El Jazi and Taxes. Um, dot C's for hand, more hand disruption and Fatal Push for removal. Um, and lands are just like Iganjo for like some uh, combat tricks. Uh, Tekanuma to get one of your creatures back. Just a one of and then some waste. Mutavolt for uh, man creatures or land creatures. Uh, if you want a like a comprehensive best of three version, that's why I'm gonna put the link in the description below for like Legend, who I got the deck idea from. So here we got I can play Professor of Symbology, um, but other than that, uh. I guess if I keep this hand, I can learn pitch a displacer and hope I get a land. Um, and this is like, I'll be honest, I don't play best of three because I'm not good at like competitive magic. And I'm not good at like discerning what's a keepable hand on draw versus uh, play. Um, but I'll keep the hand. If it's a if it's a hand that should be Mulligan, then uh, let me know in the comments below, and I'll have have to learn. So we got we drew our third land, so that's good. I don't know what the meta is for historic. Uh, historic is kind of like all over the place, just because. Um, it's like historic has basically all the cards in the format. There's like a few banned cards, but other than that, it's I don't know. I'm not sure what what people are playing. I am going to aberration this tutelage. A little bit about me, I'm not a fan of Mill. I think Mill is a terrible win con. If you play it, you know, it's whatever. Uh, but I just, I don't see how it's a fair win condition. So it looks like this player is trying to make Krakens. So, um, let's play this land and I guess I'll drop a displacer 
Because I can displace the Kraken's Phoenix. Um, yeah, if you if you watch any of my stuff, I usually just post uh, videos that I've streamed on Twitch or if I ever stream on YouTube. Um, I'm not really like someone who makes YouTube videos like this. I I tried with like another YouTube channel. I tried to do playthroughs and all that. Uh, it just didn't work out for me. So, I don't have any colorless mana, so I can't really use Displacer or Cast Thought Knots here. But I guess I I will go ahead and Apparition their Ominous Seas with the highest. And I'll just hold back. Yeah. They're probably not doing much. Just looks like their deck is just drawing cards and it looks like Blitz of the Thunder Raptor at Raptor is like one of their few removal pieces. Um let's see. If I play the expert out, what are they doing? Battle Frost Fire. Get rid of one of them. I guess I'll go ahead and attack because they're gonna launch one of the other one. So might as well get some damage in. Yep. It's a clean sweep. Oh well. Uh I guess all apparition or other ominous seas. Let me just play the land out. It's hard to um, figure out what how this deck performs and what you're supposed to do when the format is very like chaotic. Because like I said, historic is just like there's so much going on because you have access to the entire library. Um, that's like playing... Uh, I guess I'll exile their... That card. I can't really a gun... A, a ganjo? I'll just, uh, pass. What is this? So they draw a card and they cast a big spell. More ominous seas. Card draw. Definitely won't be transforming Graveyard Trespasser anytime soon. But yeah, let me know in the comments below if this is something you like. And if not, that's totally cool. I don't record these videos very often. Um, uh, let's see... I guess... I don't do these videos very often. I'm a s mostly a streamer. Because um, I'm bad at like keeping a dialogue going. So that was a win. I was playing off camera and basically you had displacer, you had symbology, you had expert out or apparition. I was just like constantly like flickering apparition, exiling their creatures, exiling their tokens, and then on upkeep exiling or like flickering expert to hand disruption uh, after they draw. So this hand, I can play Symbology, I can play Th Thalia, but these Fatal Pushes are useless unless I draw Swamp. But if I draw a third lane, I can, uh, Displacer can be online, so I guess I'll keep it. 
I don't mind using in a ganjo. And then we can go symbology, pitch, uh, push. And unfortunately, we didn't get a swamp. Oh, here we go. Uh, swing in with symbology and. Uh, looks like they're. They are probably playing like a Forsaken Monument type deck. Um, here, I'll go ahead and run out Dahlia. Because they're. If they're playing like the Colorless Ulamog deck, their cards are probably going to be more expensive. Here we can. Uh, we can go ahead and apparition while here. And they scoop. Quick game. My only I only changed like a couple things. I added a loadstone goal, like I said. So this hand I didn't really like specify, but um, I can play out Thalia and Expert. Are they playing oven? Not really a fan. They might not have enough mana now to do what they want to do, but... Okay. So they're just gonna steal Talia to swing. That's fine. Let's see what they got going on. Yeah, they're Mayhem Devil Deck. So they can't do both. They can only steal Talia and then attack with attack me again. Oh, they're not going to okay. I figured they would, uh... I figured they would go for the attack. Or steal and then attack me. Here, let me just, um... Let me just force them to use... Village rights. And then I can use Graveyard Trespasser to get rid of their... Get rid of the call, Cauldron Familiar next turn. Because this is probably... Oh, okay. They didn't even bother. That's weird. Figured they would want it in their graveyard. Yeah. Attack me and then use Village Rights? Sure. That's fine. Let me uh, play this out. Pull up their token. Attack for two. See what they. I am taking a lot of damage from my cards, but. No. Oh well. That's another thing you'll have to watch out for is, um, you don't have to use these caves, but with the Thoughtseize and the caves, it's going to be like three damage. Or like, say your hand is really awkward, you don't, you're like barely anything. So I can, uh, see what they got. Yeah. Wow, they didn't block. I figured they would block. I mean, I'm not gonna... 
just say kill Paula. You know. So I mean, this deck can be like a glass cannon build. Um. It's not necessarily the uh, the most efficient. It's not most necessarily the most efficient deck because you know I'm I'm basically only losing to uh, to all the life loss and whatnot. I guess I'll just get rid of their mayhem devil. I don't know if they have some, uh, they're playing Takenuma or playing some kind of creature recursion, but they didn't cast any spells, which is good for me. Only two cards, okay. That's good for me that they didn't cast anything, so. Alright. Um, I guess I can just play Displacer and then say go. Because I don't know what they do here. Play another Priest. That's fine. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't think they had any answers. Yeah, that's basically uh, another just brief, brief look, another uh, look at what the deck is. Uh, I'll put Legends link in the description below. Um, but I just wanted to show this deck off real quick and hopefully you guys enjoy it and you guys stay safe and have a great week.